Sir, what is the difference between non-generic aerialist and a generic aerialist, right? Sir, just observe. It is the non-generic version of aerialist object. Yes, obviously. This one is generic version of aerialist object. Are you getting that? It is the generic version. Next, uh, for this aerialist, have you observed, right? For this aerialist, we can add any type of object. Any type of object and hence it is not type safe. Remember this. Sir, for this aerialist, we can add any type of object and hence it is not type safe. Sir, for this aerialist, we can add only string type of objects and hence it is type safe. Remember that. Sir, if it is the normal, non-generic aerialist, we can add any type of object. There is no guarantee for the type of elements present inside this aerialist. That's why it is not type safe. Are you getting? It is not type safe. But what about this one, sir? For this aerialist, we can add only string type of objects and hence it is type safe. Sir, type safety is there. Next, third one, sir. At the time of retrieval, okay, we should perform typecasting. At the time of retrieval, we should perform typecasting. Otherwise, we will get what? Compatible error. Hence, uh, typecasting is the bigger headache in non-generic collection. But uh, here, there is a guarantee for the type of elements. That's why typecasting is not required. Observe, at the time of retrieval, it is not required to perform typecasting. Hence, uh, typecasting headaches are not there in generic collections. Clear for all of you, right? Sir, this is about what is the need of generics concept came in the 1.5 version right 